It is my favorite thing to do, dish entertainment news, and who better to do it with than my groupers and scoopers. Yay. It is time for Groove Scoop, and this is the first time that we have Abrielle Swisher joining yes, us today. I'm to be here. Okay, I'm going to tell a little bit about you, okay? okay? Everybody needs to know that you are the producer for the Chris Merrill Show on yes. KFYI, and you do yep. a fantastic job. Thank you. So thanks for joining us thank today. You, and then you. we have Carly Garcia. Oh. She was our intern, and she'll be graduating ASU pretty soon, so yep. welcome to the round table, Diva. <laughs> Oh yeah, go send devil. All right, we got a lot to talk about today. We got to get right into it. Someone I hate to talk about, Kanye West, but he's always in the news, and now he's doing it again with Taylor Swift and his song Famous. The beef continues. What do you girls think about this? Let's start with you, Abrielle. I'm not a Kanye fan at yeah. all. I could do without Kanye any mm -hmm. day of the week. So I'm a Taylor fan, so yeah. I'm I'm on her side all the way. Kanye's always getting the beef, but now he's gunning for Taylor, and mm -hmm. he's you know putting her in his song, saying that he made her you know, famous. He made her famous, and so she's, you know, not gonna have that. No. I think it's always a PR stunt, too. Anything with Kanye involved, it's PR. Right. It's a PR stunt, so I don't even want to pay attention to it. Well, he's a it. genius when it comes to that. He really oh, knows yeah. how to keep his name out in the paper and then people talking oh, about absolutely. it. Mm -hmm. Every week there's something either about the Kardashians mm -hmm. or Kanye West. But now it looks like he's trying to keep digging at Taylor Swift, who's this innocent, sweet girl who's done amazing work. And then he even tweeted out that he got permission from her, the okay, to put her name in the song to make her famous, and she's all right with it. But I don't think yeah. that's true. Sure, mm -hmm. yeah. I don't think that's true at all. I think this is just him adding on fuel to the fire. Oh, well, there's the bell. That means we got to move on okay, to another story. No more Kanye. Okay, let's talk Actually, about Kesha. Right. Let's yeah, talk so about now we're continuing with Taylor. Yeah. yeah. So she's got a lot of bad blood coming to her, you know. No yeah. pun intended. <laughs> and because she donated $250,000 to help Kesha yes. with her legal fund, because Kesha's in this battle now saying that her record executive, you know, allegedly raped her. Mm -hmm. And then Demi Lovato gets on board and she's making her comments. So do you guys think that this is girl power or is this negativity? What do you think? I mean, I think the whole fact that Taylor's donating this money mm -hmm. to help Kesha because she hasn't been able to make money on her own is very nice. Right. But I do understand where Demi's coming from saying, you know, if you want to make a statement, say something about it, take it to Capitol Hill. Right, so she I get has that. a voice. Right. She has a voice. I think uh, when you're in the industry, I think you know kind of reputations of people. I don't think all these female artists would be backing her up if it was just out of thin air. I think right. it's something that actually is something that needs to be paid attention to. Mm -hmm. So uh, I, I get where Demi's coming from mm -hmm. too, where it's right. kind of like pay attention to the actual, you know, don't don't draw attention in different directions, but that's what she ended up kind of doing. And then she backpedaled by posting on Instagram. I know, I, I saw that. I mm -hmm. just think it's something that needs to uh, be taken seriously. Mm -hmm. I agree. And you Absolutely. know, Lady Gaga was back in Kesha. Also, a lot of um, Kelly, Clarkson Kelly Clarkson said that, you know, I support her because as women, we need to stick together. And mm -hmm. this is a serious issue. So if someone is having a problem or making that kind of a statement, you want to know that there's some support out there from your fellow comrades in the business. So I think Kesha was, you know, doing right by putting it out there and just asking for some right. support. So. Definitely. Mm -hmm. All right, once again, we're going to talk about Kanye West. Not well, that we're going to talk we about just him. can't get away from him. <laughs> but He's here's everywhere. the thing. He puts himself in these weird situations and now he's like hitting up Mark Zuckerberg he's the CEO mm -hmm, of Facebook wanting a billion dollars I mean I want a billion dead. dollars yeah don't we all so Mark Zuckerberg you know come over to AZTV we yeah could, we could use some of that <laughs> if you don't want to give it to Kanye we'll take it no and then he was like well no I was just tagging on to another um you know, tweet that I had saw, right. and then people were saying that maybe he was <clears throat> drunk when he did it. I it's, don't know. And I'm sure it's all PR. It is oh, all absolutely. PR. I saw a list of all his tweets, and some of the first letters spelled mm -hmm. everything, spelled out some like "I am king" or something like that. Oh it's yeah. All a PR stunt. It all. I mean, he's with I, the I'm Kardashians. I'm, I'm, I'm convinced that, so that he yeah. just goes on Twitter and says, "What can I say to piss the world oh, off yeah. now?" Yeah. And just sends it out. Yeah. And he has Absolutely. a creative way of turning it. And it all comes back to him. Mm -hmm. right. Well, we're gonna have to soon wrap up here, but let's get to Adele. Now, her Grammy performance wasn't the best, and she was one of the most anticipated artists to mm -hmm. perform. Mm -hmm. The She's mic amazing. problems and everything. So she even put out there that she cried the next day because yes. she was so upset. But then she went on Ellen and she redeemed herself. So what do you think about her issue on Ellen? That was awesome. Well, Oh, I loved it. And also, <laughs> she did tweet out that she's treating herself to in and out mm -hmm. after the whole thing. Loved I was it. like, oh, girl she, after my own heart. She's burgers. I love, yeah. oh, I love Adele. So I just think that she she's always fun to watch on mm -hmm. any any um she's so talented. show. Yeah, yeah, she's great. She's hilarious. She's so down to earth. She is. And I love that she just addressed it. You know, I knew right. it. she said I knew exactly what it was. The mic mm -hmm. fell into the chords, and that's what made it sound like a guitar. You know, and she said if if it happens again next time, I'll stop and yeah and clean and the It slate. wasn't her yeah. fault, so we can't blame her. But right. we we're so happy that she was there. All right, it looks like that's the end of Groove Scoop, and it goes so fast, I told you that guys. Was fun, but though. Thank it was you fun. for joining me. We'll thank be back you. with more inside the morning scramble.